haven't been doing that either. I think yeah. He needs a hard time. No, I got my new signs on my truck and I've been getting from the phone call the bass. I made fried chicken earlier. I had fried chicken for lunch. <laughs> Fried <laughs> it myself, even. <laughs> oh, shit. Are, isn't your panels always open? Usually, yeah. Bethy, you're old and gay. Well, shout out to you, sister. <laughs> oh, wait for it. Wait for it. Bitch, I say gray, not gay. Well, you find yourself doing 25 to life, I bet you be gay real quick. Squid it. Ain't got a lot to kick it. We don't kick some. Told you. <coughs> what? Did you miss me, motherfuckers? I mean... <laughs> I think I slapped somebody so hard today. His head spun so far around, he didn't hit Jesus. <laughs> Oh, Miss Joe, you've been doing it as long as I have. It's real easy. It's down to a science. I didn't make nothing today. I had pizza. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll be enough. I haven't eaten it all today. Why? Are you on some kind of starvation diet? No. I just forgot to take something out. <laughs> what? So if, if you don't take something out the freezer, you don't eat? Why not? Because I don't feel like cooking late at night. Well, there's lots of stuff that don't need meat. Oh, I know that. Can a whole milk fucking chili? I mean, you don't not eat because you didn't take something out the freezer? No. No. I just don't feel like eating tonight. Sorry, no big deal. It's gonna hurt me. Yeah, that's real hard. I work on a fat and sassy kid. I'm trying to lose the fat and sassy kid. <laughs> Put that away. <laughs> yeah, that's real healthy. Yeah. If you don't hear from Reaper, it's because uh, nobody has found him in his apartment yet. What? They'll find him when uh, the cold wears off and it starts to stink. You know what I mean? I ain't dead. So a lot. And besides, I think I could skip one. I ate this morning, I ate this afternoon, so I'm good. I ain't going to die from wetness and wool. Well, how do you have nothing to eat till you ate this morning and this afternoon, you knucklehead? No, I said that I didn't eat anything right at the moment. Meaning tonight, not. I didn't say anything about this morning. You know, I didn't say breakfast and lunch. What are you saying, uh, AYF? You want me to go on down to Austin to the spam capital and get you a t shirt or something? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking spam. Man, you open something up and there's a jelly, <laughs> get rid of it. Don't eat that, all right? Nobody's that hungry. Get rid of it. I mean, if I'm if I'm real fucking hungry, I'll eat some fried spam. I've been drowning ketchup, but regardless, no. If I, if I open something up and there's a gelatinous substance, uh, I'm not eating that, okay? Nope. It's not happening. No, no, hell to the no. I go by the uh, famous words of George Garland. If it don't look right, sound right, or smell right, I'm not eating that. It hasn't failed me yet, and I don't think it ever will. It's pretty good so far. Shout out to Garland. <coughs> mm -hmm. If you're a fan, you know his song. Bad shit, bad shit, dirty old twat. 69 assholes died in a knot. Hooray, lizard shit, fuck. Jello shots. I don't drink. Let me see. Reaper night. Oh, okay. The amount of, work, amount of shit that I've been doing this week, shit, a jello shot wouldn't be a bad idea. You can't handle much stronger than a jello shot. No. You're right. If you make it with Boone's Farm, <laughs> <laughs> make him some Mad Dog 2020 shots. He's good for about one and a half. Uh, mad dog be one period. I mean, I'll, I'll be that. Yeah, 
I like Jello, sister. Don't get them twisted. I just don't like Jello with my meat. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Here, eat this wagyu beef. Fuck off. I can eat fat for a whole lot cheaper. All right, you ain't full of meat. Nasty. Oh, that's delicious. It's got like this spongy. No, no, no meat should be described as spongy. All right, if your meat is fucking spongy, that's not fucking good. No. Quit paying all that money for fucking fat. It is. Hey, Bern. I'm a picky eater. What's up, Bernie? I am a fussy eater. I, as you get older, your palate changes. So, I like a few things that I didn't used to, but not many. I'm getting more brave. I guess. Like, okay, I'll try that. Hey, you, nope. Hey, D Jones. That's neat. I would love to have me some lobster, some jumbo fucking shrimp, but yeah, it wouldn't go well. <laughs> so I'll stick to my uh, cod and my fish sandwich at Culver's, all right? That's about as brave as I get. I will go to the, if I run into a Gordon Ramsay's like fish and chip shop, I, I missed it in Vegas next time, maybe. I see one of them, I'll definitely try it. That shit looks good. But I like my fish with miracle oil. I'm a weirdo. I like tartar sauce. Yeah, I know AYF. It does sound like that. Sorry, it's a New England crappy accent. It does really hard. What? When it comes down to saying burn, it sounded like I. It sounded like I said bird. <laughs> I, I didn't throw that V out there like that, so it sounded like I said bird. That, I think that one got tired and feathered today. I could be wrong. <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> It was a good day. I had a great lunch. Show did. Man. Well, you can't, you can't even spell it. So how do you know if you like it? <laughs> know what I mean? Oh, Hell's Kitchen, it's overrated. I would, I wouldn't go to any of them fucking places. Hell no. It don't make a, I mean, the name says it all. I mean, Hell's Kitchen should be enough to say, do I want to? It's ridiculous. I was raised by an executive chef. I know good food when I fucking see it. And we go to the fucking steakhouses and pay all that fucking money for a steak. I could have got a Texas Roadhouse. That's it. Don't do it, people. You're wasting your fucking money. Yeah, $40 steak. I can get one over in the Roadhouse for fucking, what, 10 bucks? You can go to one here and dinner for two costs fifteen hundred bucks. No joke. Damn. It's a little spendy. My still my favorite is over at St. Paul, um, Mancini's. The Mancini's. It's like the old mobster, you know, like mobster steakhouse, I guess. But but it's a steak Italian. I don't know. It's got the, you know the horseshoe seats and. The lights are dim. I just got that gangster look to it when you walk in. It's fucking cool. Hey, sweets. What's that sweet? Like back in the, you know, in the like casino. You walk into those restaurants and there's the big booths. It's really cool. Yeah, AYF, I am. I'm trying to get me some. I'm trying to get me a couple of bacons in here, but. Yeah, you like bacons. <laughs> <laughs> Man, they got the thighs. I got, I got something to hang on to. I like devil eggs. I don't like the white. <laughs> Bernie, I'm that weirdo that scoops out the yolk and throws away the egg bite. The devil eggs. I don't like the egg bites. You know what? A lot of people actually fucking do that, too. He just but said he likes the biggins. AYF. He literally just said he likes the biggins. Mm -hmm. And girth and uh, circumference and tight sauce. He likes a big booty hole. Hop with it. You know what I'm saying? She gotta have them love handles, baby. Gotta have them love handles. Junk in the truck. to hold on to, man. When, when, when. <laughs> well, someday you'll catch your white buffalo. Hell no. Yeah, okay. I don't need that old. I don't need something that old and fucking furry. Thank you very much. I'm good without it. Raper is on the prowl, ladies. Look out. I'm taking. Thanks. <laughs> It's crazy how much of a, you know, that bitch is a whore. Reaper, since when did having one fella make a woman a whore? 
Can you tell me? Wait, what? Yeah, I'm trying to figure it out. I'm baffled. Wait a minute. Now you got me scratching my head here. How the hell is that a possibility when you're with one, when the person that, no. Right. Dude, you ain't no damn whore if you're with one person. Mm -hmm. Right. But according to YouTube, no, you know. I mean, if you're with multiple dudes, then yeah, I can see you being a hoe. You know, even for a guy, I'll call you a hoe too. I mean, if you're with multiple women, man, you're a fucking, you're not a player, you're a hoe. What's well, kind of funny, especially when uh, the whore calling me a whore has been with more men this year than I have. Because I've been with my man. I have one. So, uh-oh. That just don't make no damn sense. That's just fucking stupid-ass sense right there. Looks like the whore to me is uh, you. There's sunken jowls. You're it's banging around dating. a bunch of dudes and you're fucked up. I'm the red pill. <laughs> <laughs> Look, if you come on YouTube and you believe everything that fucking you hear these people up here talking shit about, unless you saw it, you were there for it, you, you get receipts being played out in front of you, call bullshit, because that's all it is. Bullshit. If somebody acts like they know this much about somebody's life, especially when it comes to their children, she's like, that tells you everything you need to know right there. This person full of shit. Don't even come out here and pretend to, to know that you know anything like that about somebody else on here. You're an idiot. You're just like...